hello guys welcome to another video tutorial by no code africa in this tutorial i'm going to walk you through how to use bolt to import uh your files from figma directly inside bolt so you can actually build your mobile application without having to write a single line of code just using prompt who is excited i'm excited actually so let's go ahead and check it out and see how possible this is. Now, and it says here, what do you want to build? Well, we want to build a food delivery application, all right? We have, want to build a food delivery application using Bolt. Uh, we're not building the entire thing, we just want to build one screen. Uh, and the way it works is, you can actually come here and tell Bolt what you want to build. You can say, I want to build a food delivery application, and it'll build it for you. But now, what if you have like uh, a ready-made design in Figma, or maybe you've just seen a beautiful design that is available for free on the Figma community like I have, and you just want to build something exactly like that. So what you do is, you need to go ahead and connect your Figma to Bolt by clicking this button, and then clicking on login to Figma, then it will bring up a couple of prompts like allow access, like this one. And after that, you will you would have been able to like co connect both of them. And uh, after that, the next thing you just need to do is click here again, and it will ask you to paste Figma URL here. Okay, so now the Figma URL is not this particular URL. Of course, if you copy it here and take it to Bolt and just paste it here, it will tell you link is incorrect. Please select the Figma frame URL. So what we need to actually copy is go here and click on open in Figma and go straight to the main design inside Flutterflow. So we can actually look for something you know nice here to build. Uh, we can try something like this, I guess. Let's go ahead and try to replicate this particular screen. I'm going to just click on the name of the screen and then just look for anywhere around here to right click and then go to copy slash paste as then click on copy link to selection. Then I will come back to my Bolt application and paste the link here and click on import Figma frame into Bolt. Wait a couple of seconds. It could take up to a minute or more. And then you will be able to get the design directly inside Bolt, very clean design. So let's see what Bolt is going to do for us and uh, we can pick it up from there. Meanwhile, if I told you you're new to this channel uh, or you have actually not su subscribed to this channel before, just go ahead and click on the subscribe button to encourage us to keep doing what we're doing here. And then of course, like this video as well because it's going to be very educational. It's already educational so far. So we're waiting for a couple of seconds. It says here hang tight. So let's go ahead and do just that. Now in a couple of seconds, it will finish generating the code. Uh, it actually says that there is an error. So I'm just gonna click on try again. Uh, I'm gonna paste it here and click on import frame. Generating code, let's see if it's gonna work this time. Okay, so I, I think we did hit some errors there. I hope we don't get to hit any other error again okay so while we're waiting uh i hope that you know that this is the future of app development uh if you're a traditional developer watching this particular tutorial uh, i am sure that you already know that this is where the world is headed when it comes to application development so it still says you hang tight so i'm really hoping that uh, me hanging tight wouldn't be a waste of time because I really wanted to generate the code and upload the assets and run the application for us to see. So now it's uploading the assets. The next thing it's going to do is to uh, run the application. Okay, it's, it's installing the dependencies now. So let's, uh, let's believe that it's going to run it to the end. Uh, I think the only problem here might just be my network, really, not the platform itself. It's amazing, really, what they've built here. So uh, once it is done installing the dependencies, the next thing is for it to, uh, for us to go ahead and then like start the application. It to start the application on its own. Um, I think it's gonna do that on its own actually. So yeah, it did. So now this is how the application looks like. Yeah. So. Uh, this is how it looks like, and uh, this is not images, guys. This is coding, and for you to know that it's coding is when you click on this side, you see the code that makes up all of this. 
Uh, there's a readme file here that is in is in a Markdown format. All right, then this is us previewing the uh, you know the screen. So I would like us to just go ahead and add something else. Let me just tell you to add a button, a light and dark mode button to the design. Right, so I just wanted to add a light and dark mode button to the design so uh, I can just like toggle on it and it will make this page dark and make it light mode as I please. So um, I think it's currently doing the installing dependencies. Once it's done, it's going to go ahead and uh, update the entire thing for us. So meanwhile, meanwhile, I hope that you're already enjoying this. The aim of the tutorial was just to show you how to import uh, the design, a design from your Figma into Bolt, and we have achieved that. This one is just to show you that you can also do a couple of manipulations, a good number of manipulations uh, to the design using Bolt. Now, we're gonna see the design and how it looks like. It has already loaded, but for some reason it's not showing. Okay, so this is it. It removed the other icon and put this one, that's okay. So I can click on this and you see it's really beautiful and it's very correct. Really beautiful and it's correct beautiful and correct. So you can actually go ahead and then just think about what you would want to do uh, to your application and just uh, tell it here in a descriptive manner and it will do it for you. I hope that you've learned something today. I hope you've learned how to actually import your file from Figma into Bolt to build your mobile application without having to write a single line of code. You can check uh, the description under this video for the links to the resources that we have used so far in this video. Uh, meanwhile, remember to drop a like on this video and also subscribe to this channel to encourage us to keep doing this. All right, take care of yourself and see you in the next tutorial. Bye for now.